Hi everyone, welcome to Halliday's Kitchen. Today we're going to be doing barbecue chicken that's been marinated and we're going to cook it on the big green egg. Let's get started. First, let's start by making the marinade. We'll start with some olive oil. And then some kosher salt, followed by some paprika, cumin, a little cayenne pepper to your taste, as hot as you want it. A little bit of chopped garlic. I go ahead and use the bottled garlic because it's easier. Some chopped onions. Some parsley. And some fresh cracked pepper. And of course, wouldn't be complete without a little beer. And well, just don't let the beer go to waste, so. Give it a little mix and uh, let it get happy. And then we'll go ahead and we will get our chicken ready for the marinade. Go ahead by trimming the chicken. I like to get those little bits of fat, those little veins, uh, that one vein of fat out of there and any left that, the, uh, that they left in the butchering process. So I go ahead and clean off as much fat as I can uh, out of the chicken. And I like to go ahead and cover them with cellophane and pat them out so they're the same size so they cook evenly. Then we're gonna go ahead and put the marinade in with the chicken. While that's getting happy, let's make a barbecue sauce. Starting off with some tomato paste and then some maple syrup from Vermont or Canada, preferably. A little bit of red wine or white wine vinegar, whatever you have on hand, onion and garlic powder. Some kosher salt, a little chili powder, and some liquid smoke. Exact details are in the description below. Now we'll give that a little stir, mix it all up, and of course, give it a taste to see if there's any changes that we wanna make it. Mm, that was good. Cover it up and let that sit in the refrigerator. In the meantime, don't forget to go ahead and rotate or mix up your marinated chicken. And now we'll get the grill going, the big green egg with the lighting up the lump charcoal until it's kind of volcano hot. And now we'll add some wood chips. I'm using hickory here. Just add it on top of that little inferno and get it till it's nice and smoky. And now we're ready to put the chicken on the grate after they've been cleaned. And that fire will go down once you close the lid there, so not to worry about that. I like to keep the egg at about 375 when cooking chicken. So after about 10 or so minutes, go ahead and flip them around when they're just starting to get some color on them. And after another eight or so minutes, I'll go ahead and check the temperature. When they're just getting close to where I want them to be, I'm gonna go ahead and put that barbecue sauce that we created over the side and then go ahead and flip them over to start getting some uh, caramelization on them. Then add some more barbecue sauce on the back side of them. And once they re reach the desired temperature, go ahead and take them off and go ahead and let them rest for a little bit and get them ready for plating, which we have here. And as you can see, we got some delicious, tender barbecue chicken cooked on the big green egg with some homemade barbecue sauce. Thanks for watching everyone and please subscribe for some more videos coming soon.